What is up guys, this is Alex and this is the second video with this Dell G15 which has the AMD processor which is the 6000 series. I'm gonna put the specs here and the timestamps but this will be a very shorter video compared to the first one if you haven't seen it. So the second one which is this one is does it run DaVinci Resolve or can we actually do something about it? And the first video it was the complete review of this laptop with gaming components. So I have installed DaVinci Resolve on it. This is the free edition, so let's just launch it. It should work. Officially, here are the specs which you should run DaVinci Resolve, but obviously the more the better. So if you intend to do some 4K and stuff like that, you might want to bump up the specs a little bit and there are different models of this laptop. So DaVinci Resolve can just start correctly. I've included here a hardware monitor so we can look at what is actually being used or not and the speed of the drive and stuff like that. And I'll put another image of the speed of the drives so you can actually see uh, how it compares with my other machine which has fastest SSD possible that you can buy right now in single mold. Let's try to play this. Uh, I believe this is a no, this is a HD timeline. 30 FPS should be okay. The screen is being rendered in 1080p and the playback everything is disabled. So optimized media is not available. Proxy is disabled and render cache is at none. Just to show you the raw power obviously if you enable that it's gonna go a little bit better so this file here is actually let's all see in the inspector file so this is a 1440p file so let's just go for it so let's play okay so you can see that the fps is going well at 30 fps i might lower the volume a little bit <laughs> so yeah 30 fps is going great just for the playback, if we could look at the stats on the right, processor 50% max. So let's stop it. So stopping is very clear and cut. Starting as a slight, slight delay. Not every time, just sometimes. So let's try the other thing that I have on my left here, which is two streams at the same time. So there's the PC one at 1440p and the uh, laptop one at 1080p, but it's all played here on this SSD. Acceptable. And if we get P, full screen. It's working great. It's rendering at 30 FPS. Seems to be uh, awesome. Let's go back here, play. Play. Small lag when going for multiple streams of uh, files. Okay, let's go just a little bit earlier. It's the same kind of configuration. So 1080p and 1440p playing. So there's a little, you see that there's a little, when I change, little thing going on. But besides that, Everything seems to be fine. Oh yeah, scrubbing is uh, laggy. And remember, this is raw power, nothing else. And if I go here, directly, the fans are started. <laughs> In case you're wondering. So let's go left and right here, just to see. Boost the culpit. The 3050 seems to handle pretty much everything. It's almost sleeping. So the question is, what's hanging? What's hanging? And the answer is we don't know. Let's check out that guy. Obviously DaVinci Resolve is pulling a lot of resources. That's fine. It is rushing probably the CPU. At that point, yeah, it's going to 100% when you're scrubbing a lot. It's like jumping all around. So there is an option if you have that particular setup uh, to have a more powerful CPU. So let's play some 4K. Yeah, it hangs a little bit more. I see the memory rising, but besides that, 
probably a CPU limitation. You see it going to 80 there. Uh, oh, that explained a few things. <laughs> that was, I was playing that with noise reduction in a curve. What if I remove them? Let's remove stabilization also. Still, in the, yeah, still, still the processor. That is rushing a little bit, but for the rest. And that's not DaVinci Resolve 17. That's actually 18 beta 5, I think it is. Hopefully you like this video, guys, and don't miss, of course, the first video if you already seen it or not. I'm gonna put it here. And the next video will be questions that my mom asked me for this laptop for being a day trader. So really interesting questions. Take care guys, like and subscribe and see you in the next video.